contact is not a contract. You may even get a phone call. Coach Evers in baseball last year, one of our coaches worked his baseball camp in the dugout. During the middle of camp, they're running drills on the field. Beautiful field to Evers. Head coach pulls out the seat while they're running drills. You're my number one outfielder, you know that, right? I need to get a decision from you. You ready to take our offer? Well, coach, need a little more time. All right, hurry up and let me know. I got to know. Okay, coach. Call number two. John, you know you're my number one outfielder, right? You ready to sign? Coach, need a little more time. Okay. Michael, number three on the list. You're my number one outfielder. These guys are all pretty equal. The guys in the top probably have the best grades that are equal athletically to the ones that are in the middle of the top ten. The guys in the bottom of the top ten, probably just a little bit less as an athlete, but they're good. They could play here. I'm just going for the home runs. Now, college coaches experience this every year. Players one through five on my recruiting board, I'm never going to get. Why don't they get their top five? They must be horrible recruiters. Well, how about this? Other colleges are recruiting those kids too. And those kids are looking at other colleges. You only want me to recruit you, right? Yeah. That'd be nice. How many colleges are you going to look at if you can? As many as I can. <laughs> so you can cheat on me, but you don't want me to cheat on you. See, my problem as a college coach.